Hey guys, Bethany Drew here. I made it. Whew. I told you it'd be a few minutes late. Um, I was thankful just to, I literally just ran in with my son, got him on the computer um, to play some Nick Jr. games. So um, I normally don't run to church, but I was at the church for a meeting just before this, but still wanted to come on um, because I'm so excited about all the new things um, that are coming out with our coordination products for celebration, um, things that will coordinate uh, dyes and paper, and I've kind of tried to show you a couple things, but now they're available today, yay! And this month, uh, February 17th actually is the day that um, is my stamp anniversary day, and I will have been doing this for 15 years. Can you believe that? Um, so I've been doing it, and I love it more and more all the time. Um, it is, um, just, it's my favorite hobby. I love it so much. So hopefully you can tell that I love it. Um, which is why I want to share it with you guys. And I love being able to share these tips and stuff. So, and I again wanted to say thank you to you guys who come come on and uh, cheer me on and encourage me. Um, life still is busy and there are people in my life right now that are hurting and um, I'm trying to help out in different ways. But still coming into my craft room, no matter how messy it is, <laughs> um, is still something that's therapeutic for me. Um, I love it and it kind of feeds me um, in my time. And then also I'm able to send cards um, to others and hopefully bless them too. Um, so we are going to focus on um, today on the So Sentimental Bundle. Um, it's a really beautiful bundle. In fact, when I first looked through my spring catalog, that was one of the first bundles I knew I had to have. <laughs> So I'm excited to share it with you today. Um, and then we'll look at some of the coordination products that are um, available today as well. Um, and because it's my 15th stamp anniversary this month, um, from today, February 5th, which happens to be my half birthday too. I don't know, kind of fun too. Um, in fact, cute. Um, I had shared that with my boys yesterday, um, just on a whim. And I was like, I, I know we don't really celebrate half birthdays, but... I told him tomorrow was my happy, half, or my half birthday. And this morning, my son Colts was like, Gabe and I want to make you eggs because it's your half birthday. <laughs> so my sons helped make me some eggs this morning for breakfast because it was my half birthday. <laughs> so they can be really cute at times. Um, but because it's my stamp, stamp anniversary from today, February 5th, until February 20th, um, so for 15 days to celebrate it being my 15th, you're doing this, I'm going to give free shipping um, to anyone who orders um, this month for the, in those 15 days. Um, so in order to do that, you don't necessarily want to use, you don't want to use the hostess code. Um, you can still use a credit card and give that information to me. Um, those of you who I know and see, you could always write a check um, or give me cash too, but I can still use a credit card, um, but then I can pay for part of it, um, put part of the cost, the shipping on my credit card. And I'll pay that for you to celebrate. I've been doing this for 15 years and to say thank you to, um, there's a handful of you who've been with me those whole 15 years and some who've come in in just the last. Um, so without any further ado, let's turn it around and I will show you the bundle that we're gonna focus on. And there are a lot of awesome bundles in here. So it is hard for me to decide what to show you at what time because I love so much in here, but I'm telling you this, this is just a classic set. So this is the So Sentimental stamp set and it comes with 11 of our cling mount stamps. Um, so they are, have the clear and sticky stickers on them. And I'm telling you the cling mount stamps are very sticky. It takes some effort to peel them off, um, and you do want to even be careful with your cling mount stickers. So they are our true red rubber, um, and the cool thing about our catalogs, if you're new, is these really are true to size. So this stamp is exactly that size, and it shows uh, true to size all the shapes of the um, all the dyes that match with it. And this is really cool too. This was actually part of it, 
part of the reason that I knew I had to have it was all of these because these rectangles are all stitched and scalloped rectangles and then all of these the four other shapes are stitched as well which is so cool I love it um, and this stamp set comes with just a variety of messages to say for any occasion because wishing you so much happiness today and always that could be birthday wedding anniversary it could even be a congrats your friendship is a blessing you could say anytime just a thinking of you a thank you this calls for confetti any kind of party for you a basic if you don't know what you want to make that card for it at some point there's a little hello baby i love the font on this i can't thank you enough and sending healing hugs too for somebody that um you're praying for or that you want to get better um so here's just a couple cards in the catalog that are shown um with there and this is the fun thing about a stamp set that has um it's just sentiments because you can pair it with all kinds of things um any stamp set now when you see things that coordinate you do always want to make sure you check out the bundle price because remember when you get the stamp set and the dies matched together you get 10 percent off they give you the discount so this is the number one five three eight two eight and it's 48.50 so you're only a dollar fifty away so getting a little thing of linen thread or some dimensionals or something would put you over that fifty dollar mark and you'd earn a free celebration item so this bundle alone gives gets you close to that which is really nice um and here is the hostess code if you do want to use it for february but um like i said if you're just coming on um, February 5th through the 20th I want to give you free shipping if you order through me as a thank you all right now I'm gonna show you just a few show and tell before I go into a, making a simple card um, if you just have different kinds of designer paper um, this is just using one color of ink the Calypso coral that matches the the back of my cardstock here and petal pink just using those two colors and I just use that ink I love um, the different shapes of the dies are so so cool um, another cool thing is when you get your um, when you get your dies they come in a separate container but um, I like putting magnetic sheets down and then designer paper so and then they that sheet fits right in your case so you can keep your dies that coordinate with your stamp set all right together which is nice hi honey um so these dies all are are versatile and you can use with so many things um so i will show you um this is just using basic designer paper and your friendship is a blessing this one i embossed so um, you, if you have a Versamark pad and you have embossing powder, um, this is a pretty way to make um, it look a little bit more, bit more professional. And the big shot with all of our embossing folders just adds another element of just looks professional. And this one I used the stitched rectangle um, to mat this bigger shape. And then I actually colored, um, this was I think vanilla trim scalloped trim that I colored using um, just using ink to color it the color that I wanted to match it with the melon mambo um, so there's the wishing you much happiness here's black and white stripes from our, in the celebration catalog you can earn it's it looks like it matches with bees um, there's gold black and white patterns and stuff and so I just used that black and white celebration paper um, again I used embossing powder to do sending healing hugs but then I stamped the same I cleaned off my stamp stamped it in black and just put the healing over that and uh, another cool um, this small blossom punch is another cool thing that you can earn for free right now during celebration time now the punch you earn for free with a hundred dollar order um, so and again if you have a hundred and fifty dollar order um, that gets you to host a status too so that would get you this and the stamp set that matches the blossom punch um, for free with your order plus $15 of 
your choice of free merchandise too because you are at hostess status but isn't this blossom just a cute little extra accent um, and this was a pretty simple card to put together now one of the examples in the catalog showed this stamp set um, that I showed you last last week in my catalog or in my live video was the birthday bonanza this calls for confetti fits perfectly in one of those smaller rectangles rectangle in the background um, of the lion with this one so I'm, I really love these stitched scalloped rectangles are cool for any any occasion and any card really um, here's some of the other shapes then used with our um, I showed you a couple weeks ago or a few weeks ago all of the poppies stamp set and designer paper are so pretty but this shape you can fit with anything so you don't necessarily have to have the stamp set that matches with these even though they look really good with them you can use other uh, sentiments too that match um, with with these shapes they're just a pretty shape to put on a card and make it simple and fast here's one with that the stamp set or the stamp I can't thank you enough from so sentimental but then added with our lilies, and again, these are a stamp set, the lilies, and then the dies are two different things you can earn for free again. Um, so it pairs well with any stamp set, um, and it works really well when you have some pretty designer paper too. Hey, Deb! I'm going, going fast through some examples here. This one I just made recently, um, and I used that scalloped rectangle in the background. Um, and paired it with the black and white paper you can get in the celebration catalog and then there's a well said stamp set and dies that I used to make the sending heartfelt sympathy there um, but man the scalloped rectangles are just a really beautiful background um, they work well like I said with any stamp set um, here's another one where I used a smaller rectangle um, scalloped piece to put the happy birthday on there and then I used that black and white paper and some of it has gold foil on it too which is pretty and I cut that into strips that was a like a layout that a lot of people were making some cards that had the same similar layout and this is all black and white in fact this card is mostly cased and copied off of uh, Mercedes Weber who's one of used to be one of the artisans and I follow her blog so I get my inspiration from people too. Then here's a cute little piggy one and I showed that to you guys a few weeks ago with the um, umbrella, the cute umbrella stamp set. Um, but again, the scalloped rectangle is just such an adorable uh, little background, um, again, for any card. It's your day and then I added little notes in there too, like he's singing in the rain, just singing in the rain. Isn't he so cute? Oh my goodness. Can't get enough of those pigs. Um, okay, so th that's just using some of the pieces, the dies, with um, that stamp set that mapped it. Now, now we can see how to make a, a card. Now I'm going to show you, because I just can't make the exact same card twice. I find I have, <laughs> I like making them different. Um, this is really gorgeous paper, and I will show you more cards uh, with that, the Dress to Impress suite um, in a later video. But I did, you just, you can't go wrong. We have so much beautiful designer paper, so I wanted to show you um, some of the paper is just gorgeous. And the, it's hard to even pick which side you want to pick. So this Dress to Impress matches with the stamp set that has the lipstick and the perfume bottle. Again, I will be showing you. Uh, and on oh, the shoes and the sentiments say something like oh I love the polka dots um, there are sentiments that say be as bold as your lipstick polka dots more flowers whimsical flowers They're, those are polka, polka dots S smaller little flowers and the shoes oh and the shoe stamp set uh, the one that goes with it says um, life is short just buy the shoes <laughs> um, some perfume bottles Ooh, deep pretty purples flowers and perfume bottles again so um, this is a gorgeous pack of design paper um, and they are six by six paper 
Um, so this is a real simple card, um, but it's so pretty. Don't you think it's so elegant? I love how the flower, the floral designer paper just adds a little something. And then I put um, my purple posy cardstock through the, it's like a basket weave, one of our newer embossing folders in the Tropical Oasis Suite. Um, and I love the texture that it gives. So the embossing folders, again, you just are putting the piece of paper in between the folder and you slide it through your, your die cutting machine. And then it, your paper comes out looking like that, which is so cool, isn't it? Love it. So you've seen the same kind of layout, but I kind of flip flopped what I embossed and I put the um, designer paper over here. This one I used your friendship is a blessing and kept it all real soft colors. And this one, um, there's a little hello baby stamp in there too. So I used the smallest two um, stitch dies that fit in that little hello baby so perfectly. And then I used um, this scalloped ribbon comes in um, all the ink colors. So the purple posy, the, the peacock color, terracotta tile. I love this linen scalloped ribbon. Isn't it pretty? It's just gorgeous. So you kind of have to manipulate it to turn it so that it's facing because the other side is actually just looks linen. But when you tie it, you can kind of twist it so that it looks the same. But this is a real basic thing. Now I'm going to show you without embossing, um, but the embossing folders do look nice. In fact, I thought um, this print kind of makes it look like a baby quilt, doesn't it? Which is why I use that for my baby card. Um, but let's make one real quick. And this one, I cut out the one that matches the thank you, so we will use the thank you. And we're going to use some um, Stampin' Write markers. Now, I already folded my petal pink color, and you might be wondering why I punched a couple flowers out. I just kind of wanted to see what that would look like if the flowers, oh, isn't that cute, kind of then peek through the front of the card. Because, um, oh, I did want to... I did that on the inside of this one too. I punched out, um, or I cut out with my Big Shot, the purple piece out of the front of the card. So it's got some cute little, um, you can see the other side of the designer paper. And it's like, on the other side, it makes it cute too. I don't think I did it on that one, no. So I just used my punch and slid it all the way as far as it would go. Um, so that when I... Although I think I wanted this over here. Let's see what I like best. Hey Chris, better late than never, right? So I think I might actually do it this way because I like better the green polka dots um, poking through. Okay, so I just wanna make sure I'm not gonna put my glue um, my snail in the areas that the little flowers are going to be poking through because I don't want my adhesive to be sticking on the inside of the card. We don't want that. So this designer paper that I'm using again with all three of these cards that I used is that dressed to impress suite um, which has so many cute different designs um, then to add just that little extra bling um, our glimmer paper is awesome for that well Chris it's okay grandkids can take precedence over my live video anytime that's an okay excuse <laughs> um, all right so I want that to be spaced So I'm going to put that strip right there, and then this will go over that, and I'm actually going to stick this one up with dimensionals just for fun. Make this layer pop up. I am a huge di dimensional fan. When you stick layers on with dimensionals, you know they're not going to, they're not going to move on you, so it's really nice. 
If you have no fingernails and you can't peel those off, always press in the center and that'll kind of lift up the top of that dimensional. And then I want to get this lined up. Oh, I'm telling you. I know some of you may be like, how, how does she do this when she's got four kids and a husband and I have to think of supper, which by the way, tonight it's going to be leftovers <laughs> for supper. Um, Wednesdays are a busy day, but you know what? This is for me even to slow down a little bit too, but I really do love to encourage you guys to, to make cards and to make time for this um, because I know life is busy and life feels like it's on fast forward at times. Um, the Stampin' Rights markers have a thin and so like a journaling tip and then a brush tip. So when you're coloring over your ink or over your stamp, here comes the snow. Is it? Oh, I see snow too. You know what? My boys would be so excited if we got a huge snowstorm because they haven't gotten to use their snowmobiles at all this summer yet. Jacob was just saying how much this winter stunk. <laughs> they really love the snowmobiles. So, so sorry to those of you who don't like snow, but our whole family's been praying for snow. It's Feb it's only February, so I'm really okay with there being some snow right now. Just at the end of March and then April, I then I want spring to come and it usually doesn't. <laughs> in full force. It's Indiana. It takes a while to know what it wants to be. All right, now I'm coloring. So I just colored with my yellow and now I'm coloring the thank you in the middle. And this is just a fun way when you want to have, um, um, even if you have a flower stamp set, it's a fun way to get two different colors. So you just color right over your, the stamp. This is, I think I showed you with the little pig stamp a few weeks ago that when you're using your markers, um, it's a great way to omit something too. If you didn't want thank you in the middle and you wanted a different word to, the, to be in the middle, you could have just not inked up the thank you and then stamped something else in the middle. I can't, I don't know what you would say. I can't love you enough. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but you could do that. All right. Now, after you've used a couple of colors, um, the real fancy technique, just huff on it. That just kind of re-wets the ink. Um, and then this, I can't thank you enough. I just love how it fits right in there so perfectly. I can't tell you how much I love these dies. You're gonna like them if you get them. And like I said, this bundle is $48.50. Um, isn't that cool then? So I can't and enough are in the yellow and the thank you. I wanted the thank you to be more bold. Um, so the thank you is in the um, Blackberry Bliss. And then that matches with the two colors. Well, there's a lot of colors in here, but um, that is another fun way to color your stamped image rather than just using one, one ink pad. The Stampin' Write markers are awesome. And then, because I've kind of been showing you, and I'll show you in the, again in the, um, yes, isn't it, Deb? Simple, very simple, but so pretty. And that's where these shapes um, just add that, that pop of elegance so quickly and so easily. Um, I mean, that card just took me to, what, a minute and a half to put together? So, so easy. Um, but real quickly, in our celebration brochure, now these are the things you can't just order, you have to earn for free. Um, I think I showed you a couple, um, the Thoughtful Bloom stamp set that matches with the punch, you earn with a $50 order. And then the Blossom Punch itself, um, which we're, we're going to use right now to just show you how to add a little extra cuteness, um, you earn with a $100 order. So it, it'll say on the pages what it takes to earn those for free. So again, if you build up a bigger order and, and choose $150 worth of stuff, um, then you get to choose, well, you could choose three 
celebration items or if you like these pairing things you could choose this one and this one and at least get two things still for free with your order and at $150 in your order you're also a hostess and then this month for February I'm also giving free shipping so that's a perfect time to do a big order and let me um, just as a thank you take care of your shipping for you um, so now with our punch I'm gonna add just a little extra um, cuteness now I punched out these two pink ones out of right out of the front of the card and then I'm gonna punch a couple blackberry bliss blooms too and I just had my one of my kit clubs came over uh, the other night just last night actually and um, I was sharing them a little trick to bend your flowers I've seen some people who, you know, go find a little mat, but I showed people, here you can see my garbage, I showed people if you have a little extra on your legs like I do, this is another reason maybe you, women have more fat than men. <laughs> um, so I just took the end of a pen and I put, pressed it down into my leg and that kind of gives it a center in your flower and gives it a little bit more uh, dimension so I'm gonna do that to all my flowers and just again pressing into my leg again if you have like a foam mat or something you could do that too and you could use the end of a pencil or the end of a pen or the end of your uh, paper piercer but that's a fun way to just give those flowers a little bit more curl isn't that fun and now we can add some, I'm going to use mini dimensionals on the back of these flowers. And let's see, what I, I think I'm just going to use three. So we'll put a little dimensional on the back of the flower. We'll put a couple down at the bottom by the saying and then we'll put one at the top and then maybe I'll put one on the inside oh maybe I should I really like aren't these purple ones just gorgeous love these purple this blackberry bliss color is awesome but I might add that on the inside of otherwise it's gonna be color on color so I'm gonna add another one of the pink ones at the top here. And that alone is pretty, but you could also um, add some more bling and if you add some rhinestones in the center. Our rhinestones already come with a little kind of glue dot on them. which is nice and if I grab my pickup tool I'm just gonna add add some little rhinestones in the centers of those flowers and then you've just stepped up your card just a little bit more. Isn't that cute? And a, a fast and a fun way to just add a little bit more bling um, and add a little bit more color to your card. Now, to add even more fun, if you haven't seen this before, our blends markers, now this is Mango Melody, so it's kind of an orangish color, but your blends can actually color right over rhinestones, pearls, plastic, anything plastic, it will color right on. So I'm actually adding a little bit of that orange, orange yellow color to the center of my rhinestones. And then that adds a pop of little yellow in those flowers too. Isn't that fun? How oh, cool. So, so that is one way, and that's a simple, simple layout to use any of your designer paper. Um, our glimmer paper really is an awesome extra little accent of bloom 
um, or bling. And there's the same layout, but with different colors, and they all look cute, don't they? But all using our either scalloped rectangles or stitch dies from the So Sentimental stamp set. Aren't those adorable? Thanks for the love, people. Um, and yes, very simple, but awesome cards. So I hope that you liked all the cards I showed you um, with this bundle. It's, it's an amazing bundle. I love it. Um, now here's just a few extra cards made with that bloom punch. So if you weren't sold on it yet, um, it really is a pretty stamp set even. Um, but you could just get the punch by itself. Um, and then I wanted to tell you a little bit before I go, I wanted to tell you a little bit about um, our coordinating product that is available right now. Thanks, Chris. Thanks, guys, for the love. Um, so this, this little punch makes some amazing cute cards, too. Um, where's my... Now, sorry, my printer was only printing in black and white, but I've shown you this before. Um, Nature's Thoughts is a stamp set um, that is really cute. I don't have that one yet. <laughs> um, but Nature Thoughts dies match the positive thoughts in the in the caddy, um, in the spring catalog. There's special day dies that match with a special someone stamp set also in the spring catalog. Um, and again, these are being released, so you won't see these actually in a catalog. These coordination product release, um, it starts today and these things will be available as long as um, just while supplies last so this these are limited time only things which is why i would say encourage if you want any of these coordinating product to order it sooner rather than later uh, there's ladybug dies that will match with the cute little ladybug stamp set um, and my mom did earn the stamps the ladybug stamp set this is for a hostess who gets to 300 dollars in sales so if you want this one really bad please let me know if you want to have a party. Invite some friends over. Um, there are, even for beginner stampers who don't want to get all the tools, there's some cute kits that you can get, which I showed you last week. Here's a couple really quick examples and cute. That's totally monochromatic. I used a background stamp set, or a background stamp, um, that little chicken wire looking one, and Rococo Rose for the background and the bug. And then again, that scalloped linen. You're so sweet. Hey, lady. And I used the little ladybugs. So it comes with the row of four in the one stamp. And I just kind of stamped across. If you're really a perfectionist, you could use your stamparatus. Um, but I just eyeballed it and kind of tried to make it go back and forth. And then I did use the stitched rectangle there. This one I haven't put a saying on yet, but. Um, I used kind of an orange, the Cajun craze color with blues. Um, and then I embossed over vellum, too. And this one's a cute little happy birthday with the the ladybug that's flying. And I used soft sea foam and some Bermuda Bay colors with browns. I thought that turned out cute, too. Thank you. Um, so the ladybug is a cute one, um, but for just the limited time there are going to be ladybug dies that will cut those out um, that just kind of step up your game and allow you to do more the sending flower dies I actually just ordered those so I don't have an example for you yet but they match with the sending you thought stamp set which is one of our stamp sets for celebration too um, the birthday dies I showed you last week but I'll show you again um, are another cool uh, stamp set Again, this is one that you can earn for free. Happy birthday to you. Stamp set with the cake. And I love the font of the happy birthday. And you can make really simple. This is one layer, no extra cardstock at all. I colored with my blends. To here I use the stitch rectangle to really ornate and using all of the dies. Um, so the happy birthday to you dies um, have some extra leaves that it cuts out. It cuts out just the flowers. It cuts out a little stand. Um, or it can cut out the whole cake with the flowers. And isn't that cool? So I, I cut out some of the leaves that it cuts out with in the vellum and then soft sea foam to add just kind of a soft background uh, to that. Um, and even more exciting, if you guys are still listening, 
because for the first three people who order uh, starting today who order in February uh, until the 20th I have three celebration stamp sets I'm going to give away as gifts to say thank you for ordering around my 15th stamp anniversary. Um, so those are the birthday dies. That's 153590, and they're $27. And you're, you can purchase those now. Um, and then please just punch designer paper I showed you guys a while back. But again, to show you, just to remind you, because I think my favorite designer paper is the ones that have the umbrellas. So these are all just punched out with that designer paper. Are awesome. So a birthday wishes. Um, it matches the designer paper matches with the tulips. There's another umbrella one. I really had fun with the umbrellas. <laughs> Aren't they so cute? Oh my goodness. Um, but they match with the the flower blossom, the little small blossom flower punch, um, and also the hearts. So that is the designer paper. Is the coordinating paper. Uh, designer paper and it's double sided and that's one five three five five eight and it's eleven dollars and fifty cents and it coordinates with four different um, punches which is really cool um so again this is available right now and you don't have to order those things but they uh, they are awesome and they make your projects just even more versatile now i know i have a lot going on here um because i did want to share with you um this month paper pumpkin if you order um if you'd like to subscribe but maybe you're not sure you want to subscribe to paper pumpkin you can always try the prepaid paper pumpkins and just get one month three months six months or 12 months and then they're they're done after that prepaid subscription and you get a code that you, you um get emailed to you and then you enter that for just your prepaid um and again, you can do one month for $21, and this does not include the shipping. I think they do the shipping, they process the shipping after you order it. Um, but the three month is 63, the six month, now the three month prepaid, if you, if you ordered a prepaid subscription and just wanted to try February, March, and April, you have to order it before February 10th to get the February box. Um, but at $63, you would also get to choose a celebration item and then you could just try out february march and april see what you think and then go back and subscribe to it to it monthly um so i did want to mention that these are options the six month i think you get a dollar off of your subscription for each box and if you are able to just pay 220 dollars for a 12 month you know you'd get 12 boxes um it's giving you i think you get at least ten dollars off maybe 20 even um so you're you're saving money the more you pay for but i like the subscription because when you subscribe you can go in manage your account and you can suspend a month if you you know we're like oh, i don't think i want this one this month and they give you a little clue of what's coming so the subscription is always the way to go too um so right now the extra coordinating product we just talked about it is my 15th stamp anniversary so if you didn't see in the beginning of my video and you're just catching on, I'm giving free shipping to anyone who orders today through the 20th. So for 15 days, because it's my 15th year doing this, um, to say thank you for all of you who stuck out, um, stuck around these many years, and thanks to the new people I've found, I will give you free shipping. So that means don't use the hostess code. If you want me to be able to uh, pay for your shipping, I need to process it. Um, I can still send it directly to you. Um, if that works and I can still use a, your credit card um, but if I process it then I am able to pay your shipping for you which I would love to do um, and final thing Friday February 21st my holiday retreat day turned out really well and everybody had fun so I'm doing a little bit shorter thing but a Stampin' Day of Fun it, in this blah mostly gray winter time um, let's be filled with bright colors and flowers and we'll probably do a card similar to this um but it's only fifty dollars that will include twenty dollars of product six make and takes um, use of my embossing folders and dies um, it'll include i'll provide dinner for everyone i'll have free prizes for people um, people will win some prizes um, and then you bring your own projects whether you need a scrapbook or you have 
paper pumpkin boxes that you haven't put together yet or kits. Um, so you could even order some kits now because um, during these couple days, because it's so busy, I'm trying to kind of pack together two options. Uh, during Friday or Thursday the day before, I will also be open and able to help you um, if you want to do just six cards for $15, uh, you can RSVP for that by February 11th, please, so I can prepare. Um, or you can pay $29 for an all-inclusive kit. Um, and let me show you the kits real quick. Or another option is if you want to pay $32, and again, you could just pay by credit card or check. Um, and $32 would get you, because I'm giving you free shipping for the kits, would give you 16 cards um, and you get a box so this is the kit that's called um, simply the best project kit and if you just wanted to pay the $32 you're using my stamp set and my ink but you get to put together there's four of each of these designs and they've got cute little die cut pieces so they're pretty easy to put together um, so that's one of the kits is called simply the best and it comes and you would get that little box too so if you have questions please just private message me let me know if you're interested in coming to the day um, you don't have to place an order to come per se but if you want a kit to work on this would be a perfect time to order something too to bring this is the all-inclusive three cheers for you so you get a stamp set so this is the $29 option you get a stamp set, a little ink spot, and all the pieces to put together 12 cards. So this is the three cheers for you kit. And then this is the $32 option where you're getting just the pieces. So I have, I own the stamp set and you would use my ink and my stamp set and you would get to go home with a box filled with 16 cards that you put together and handmade. Um, and any of those extra pieces you get to keep. Um, so that's another option in this busy time of year you could do a simple kit and that's simple for me because it's a little preparation I just get to open your box for you <laughs> um, but so that's Thursday or Friday you can choose to just do a class um, but Friday I have room for at least 10 people who want to do the $50 option if you want to come for the day um, and even if you can't make it right at one, if you have to work till four or whatever, and you're here for the last four hours, it's still worth the $50. To, you're still getting product. You still get your make and takes. And you'll still get those that amount of hours to use my embossing folders and dies. Um, and I will also have um, cards for sale. I'll have some retired things out. If you order anything, $35 or more, I will also give you a $5 coupon for March. So I will have some fun things going on. Uh, Thursday, February 20th, and Friday, February 21st. I will put all these details again out on, on my page here too. Um, so you don't have to take a screenshot of it per se or remember all of this. I will put these details out. Um, and I will put them on my blog as well. In fact, I think I've already put most of these details on my blog, which is just the drewdaily.blogspot.com. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to my blog, make sure you do. I try to put some more pictures and details in, in my blog. And then I will also post some of my videos in there too. So again, my blog is thedrewdaily.blogspot.com. Um, so thank you guys so much for those of you who came and those of you who encourage me and uh, follow me. I love you. Um, I'm so excited that I'm celebrating 15 years with Stampin' Up! Um, I can't thank you enough. So this is just my little attempt to try to give free shipping to you guys who order in February. And then um, I forgot to tell you, these are the three stamp sets. So I have earned, because I order a ton, I've earned extra free celebration items. So I have a Thoughtful Bloom stamp set. I have Happy Birthday to You stamp set. And I have the lovely lily pad stamp set that three of you wonderful people are going to earn for free. That So that is my first three people who order starting today. So if I see you placed an order um, of $35 or more, um, I will give you free shipping. Um, so you may want to contact me first instead of using the hostess code so I can give you free shipping. Um, and... 
the first three people who order and then also share my video. So if I see, see that you have shared my video and you place an order with me of at least $35, um, I will contact you and you get to pick depending on if you're the third person you'll just get the last one available but they're all cute so you can't go wrong so um, the first person who contacts me with an order and has shared my video can choose one of these free stamp sets and then you have more options to choose something else during celebration so yay I'm hoping I can spoil you I, I wish I could give every single person another free stamp set if you ordered this month but I just I don't make that much <laughs> so thank you so much um, if you want to order go to my stamps my website um, but again if you want to get my free shipping deal you need to contact me so either private message me if you have my phone number text me um, let me know what you'd like to order and I'll contact you and get your credit card information and I can ship it directly to you and give you free shipping um, but only till the 20th okay thank you Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you, everybody who stopped by. Thanks, Deb and Chris and Kim. And I think Sherry, did you stop by too? Always try to like, uh, put a thumbs up and like my post too. I appreciate uh, the likes. That just helps it pop up more. So thank you so much. Have a wonderful day. See you guys. Look at, before I say goodbye, the snow is coming down here in Indiana. My boys will be happy to see this. All right, enjoy your day. Bye.